in the hanger we got banners bombs be dropping when i hit them with the grammar we got power it's that hour this the military that protects us that connects us to the rest of the world try to wrap my head around it it's the most powerful but my head is now inside us world Another gun video today I am using the ABR 223 as you guys know last episode I ended up using the auger DMR which you guys absolutely loved so today we're using my class setup that I used for my ABR and then next week obviously you guys are gonna be seeing the swordfish but other than that uh, we're probably just gonna hop into it here guys show you guys what's up and all that good stuff are you gonna join up or bugs you know all right how much you got left? But as you guys can see, we have a literally one day, 20 hours, 37 minutes, and 20 seconds until the next operation comes out. Super excited that week or the week or next weekend, I'm going to be grinding it out for you guys, playing that, and getting a tier 100, and all that good stuff. So it'll be one hell of a grind, but we're gonna do it. So. Hmm. Interesting camel. All right. All right. Let's invite you, bugs. Friends. All right. Invite party. There we go. <laughs> But as you guys know, my swordfish is the main gun I actually use um, for like my tactical rifles and uh, any map really. Because the, the damage sure is less with the fire, it's a hell of a lot more and you get more of a chance of getting in one shot than you do with the ABR. But besides that, it's a really good gun, we're just gonna, we're gonna test it on different maps. Hopefully we get like a long, and long, medium and short range map, we're gonna probably play map maybe a not starting off with this one. I start off my stream with that. No. What? I swear to God, if we get this map again. I swear to Christ. Thank you. Some would be a perfect example of like a medium to a short or close to reading, reading range map. So. I almost forgot my attachments that I'm using, guys, as well. <laughs> On my ABR, guys, I'm running Reflex, Quick Draw, Extended Mags, and Suppressor. You guys can switch out Suppressor. For but the reason why I run Suppressor is because it only knocks down the range one. And who doesn't want suppressed shots, considering that if you play hardcore, they're mainly one-shot kills anyway. So. Yeah. Come on, game. Really? Thank you. Really? Hi is here. Really, that's your name, bud. Okay. Mm -mm. Well, this is like I said, guys. This is a perfect example of like a medium to long range map. Or close to. Medium range, mean sorry. You already know how this is gonna go down. So, all right, here we go. We got the right class shows that we should be fine now. Hoofed up. Well, also guys, the midnight talks episode. Um, we're still trying to think of what game to should record, so that'll be going up later today for you guys. Not later, maybe about 5.30 today is when it'll go up central time. But, um, I'm trying, still trying to figure out as the day I'm recording this, which is a Sunday, the 28th, is when I'm recording this, so. Still trying to think of a game I could, um, 
do it on because I did Fortnite the last two episodes of it, so I don't want to make it a third episode in a row. So. There we go, got that kill. This is ma this is more of like a traverse weapon as well, guys. Like you want to be accurate with your shots. Make sure if you miss with the first shots, you. you sh I don't know where that guy killed me from, but alright. Oh, I should be. Uh, I'm running the wrong character. Come on, Francis. Me and you, buddy. Mm. Look dumb. But this is this is a really good medium medium range weapon considering that like the first shot is always a little bit uh, faster than the other two. Get out of here. Get out of my game. Where are they spawning, you know? Dumbass. I got my UAV care package. Care package available for tasking. Where are they spawning? I'm actually kind of scared right now. Never mind. I found him. I got shotgun. What is this game? But for the for like the what the attack and stuff like that, the reason why I only use like a reflex for like a sight I use mainly is because of the fact that it's a good it's good you, as long as you guys are accurate with your shot and stuff like that. And if you miss your first shot, you always get the next two bullets to use. So okay, well I got my sniper just coming in, so she good to go. Oh, you're being that guy, Bugsy. Oof, duh. Hostile tech deploy beacon online. Oh my god, dude. My sniper's nest is his clean house. <laughs> that's not my sentry, that's a team- that's a friendly sentry, but it's not mine. This is also a really good map to, to get score shoots and stuff on, as you guys can tell. Like 4.10 KD at the moment. Forget about it. I feel like I'm such a scumbag using this damn thing, but it's so helpful. <laughs> Won't say that, teammate's ass. <clears throat> but if you guys have not seen the Augur DMR gameplay, make sure you guys go check that out as well for more... Uh, for another... Oh, I got another care package. For another, um... Class setup. I got a drone squad. Hell yeah! I just saw my teammate. Care package. <laughs> He's salty. He's so salty. Take the win. How are you walking, buddy? He gave you an attack trapper, motherfucker. Better be happy with that. I got a teammate of attack trapper. Okay, how do you shoot me out of freaking person that's sitting in front of you? I mean, you just get. It also takes a little bit of. 
practice using these weapons too. Like when I first used the um, auger, I couldn't use the auger at all. But after I got the hang of it and how it played and stuff like that, it's pretty easy to use. Same with it's just the same with every first weapon in my opinion. As long as you're accurate and precise with your shots, you should be fine. Never a doubt. Good job. Thirty-one and nine, not terrible. What you got? Okay. You got this monkey, got it somehow. So I'll play one more match guys that is a really good example of a medium range map and how it plays and how easy it is to get kills close range and stuff like that You just got to hit fire it more, more than likely so Hey we go, well up at least Hell yeah Oh fucking course this map sucks ass cracks I hate that map <laughs> and if you guys see the damage between the a ABR, oh, never mind, I can't show you. But the ABR does more damage, sure. But for me, the swordfish with the pentaburst is actually pretty good. And here's more of a long range map. I mean, it's got its close. It's more of a long, close range map. So. I'm in this map I can spawn trap on as well. Hardcore team deathmatch. Which is good. Government troops, liquidate all hostiles. Okay, the damage isn't terrible. <laughs> Fucking teammate, get the fuck out of my way, you dumb bitch. Enemy UAV above. <laughs> and one, two. Who is the sniper that shot me? Oh, you, you cunt. See, usually this, like, I can get going in this map, it's just that you gotta join either in, like, you know, the scores are still really low, otherwise join in high, because people are gonna have their score streaks, and it's gonna be harder for you to get kills and spawn trap, unless you can get, somehow hook the spawns. Which, it's not hard to do, by any means, but... There's a guy coming that way, books, by the way. Watch yourself. Where are these guys? Are they still spawning back there? They're spawning back by, uh... Yep. So if you guys sit, like, literally right where I'm at, right outside the, um, little bunker on this side, where the fire, actual fire range is, you guys can actually get a spawn trap going if you're, if you, um, know where to aim and stuff like that, which is pretty simple to where to aim, because he's got to aim down the tunnel. <clears throat> What's the guy using an auger? Enemy UAV above. But if this is gu this gun's really easy to snap on people as well. Like if you need to do like a quick turn or something like that, or you need to aim on them quick, it's really easy to lock on. Because if you miss your first shot, like I said earlier. You're bound to hit your second. No third shot. We're done here. Well, we still ended up with a 1.14 KD ratio, which is terrible. But I thought it was you that got it for a second there. Well then. Well then, that basically concludes the video guys. Hope you guys enjoy. Like I said, if you guys want to go check out the last video, there'll be an annotation at the very end of the video. 
But the positive side is a great gun, great at all ranges. Um, but another thing I would suggest running him, if you if you decide to camp with it, is uh, run scavenger for sure. Like I, I personally don't run scavenger because I I tend to rush around a lot when I use this gun. But anyway, guys, that is the class setup for the ABR two two three. Hope you guys enjoy. Like, comment, subscribe, support troops, good soldiers. Hey, see you in the next one. That flag waving proud and true. That's the USA. Who the fuck are you to talk down on the nation when we got some battle stations placed around the globe? Everybody knows, don't fuck with us. Cause we favor independence. We'll run the way blue and Uncle Sam and he's a menace. It was us who fought off Britain, Germany, and Russia. Try to step on up to us. We will crush you. Army, Navy, Marines, Air Force, National Guard. What you care for? You wanna try and take it to our homeland? We all saw how that ended for Japan.